Hey there, guys. Yeah, today uh, I'm gonna make a video uh, about uh, driving uh, here in the highway. Yeah. So I'm heading to uh, to see my car. What's going on? And uh, probably uh, go to New York after that. So it's four o'clock and I'm trying to avoid the, the traffic and too much uh, cars. So I feel like a free man, you know, driving here and uh, just relaxing and, you know, just driving around. time to avoid you know a lot of cars and traffic it's because once around seven o'clock eight o'clock it's really uh, hectic here people are driving like a maniac everybody everybody's in, the, in a hurry uh, some people they're going to New York some people they're going up north or uh, going on vacation uh, enjoy the summer state New York so it's the perfect time yeah I don't like to drive around uh, a lot of cars and people are just you know kind of like um, they're racing or something chasing something yeah so some of you guys probably passed this uh, highway here as you can see older 
going to work, you know, they're chasing the time. So the key, I believe, is just to leave early, you know, and then you don't have to rush like crazy. You have enough time to get to your work or any place that you want to go and you are not driving really fast. And this is, that's how the accident comes. Too, this highway is going to be packed and it's going to be crazy. Yeah. So we gotta, we gotta have a game plan how to escape from this uh, mystery. Yeah, a lot of people that travel like maniacs, yeah. especially here in New Jersey. The cost of accidents just, uh, you know, it's high risk. Yeah. Fast pace. It's not like Texas. They're all laid back, you know, or Arizona, Utah. Yeah. So as you can see, the highway. I mean, it's pretty nice. Nothing is really out here. Nobody is driving. Like you'll see a couple cars, you know. So I'm not driving like 80 miles an hour. So I'm just driving like 55 miles an hour. So I'm pretty good. Yeah. You gotta watch the lane. Sometimes the road here is a little tight. Yeah, it's not Texas. See the cars are on the skin, you know. Yeah. These people are going to work or going somewhere else. Sometimes they have family down south and they spend the weekend there or something. So now they they're rushing to get home and go back to New York. Yeah. So I was checking out this uh, Lex, uh, not Lexus, uh, Jaguar. It's a uh, it's an eight-cylinder. If you can see my other video, you can see it there. It's like a classic car. It's a, it's a Jaguar, you know. Um, it's it's a lot of gas, but it, it's really it's fast. Yeah. So I was thinking getting uh, that car, but right now, this moment, I'm thinking you know twice. It's because I think there's a problem in the computer. It's there's the CEU problem in the computer I checked out on YouTube it's like a long square kind of box and you plug the computer there something like that and I believe if you go to Jaguar they do have this equipment yeah they have this equipment like probably cost like ten thousand um, dollars for these Jaguar cars with you know computer problems so I'm kind of doubting the car I mean you know like I don't want to buy it because I want to buy it but I at the same time, I I don't want to buy it because I don't like to buy cars. I mean, if, even if you guys, you know, you don't want to buy a car and there's a problem with the car, unless you sold it for five hundred dollars, that's a different story. But if you're paying like thousands of money, then you don't want to waste your money. You know, you want to make sure the car is running in the perfect condition and everything works properly. So that's what people are, you know, uh, their expectations. But uh, yeah, so I was thinking about, you know getting it but when I since when I went there and then uh, I made a vlog take a video of that car I mean it's pretty nice you know uh, it's a big car it's wide a lot of rooms inside but uh, it's just a CEU you know probably the computer yeah so uh, I was like uh, I don't know so, and then I you know I met the guy and then you know we chat he has a couple cars you know two Jaguars and he was selling. I believe it's going for divorce, but uh, it's not my business, you know what I mean? So sometimes relationships doesn't work, it doesn't work anymore. So uh, that's about it, you know? I mean, so I, I left and I told the guy, I said, I'll think about it, you know? Yeah. If you sold it for $500, psh, why not, you know? But you're gonna spend a couple thousand dollars to fix the problem with that computer the CEU problem 
so I don't know how much it will cost. It could, could cost you like a couple thousand or maybe, I don't know, more, uh, more than 5,000 maybe, who knows, so uh, it's 50-50, uh, you know. But anyways, yeah, so I'm halfway going to my, um, one of my family members and I'm gonna check out the car. Later on, you know, he's selling a, another Jaguar, but you know, since I'm already here up north, so I'm just gonna wing it where he lives and put it with GPS and then meet the guys. So. Alright, guys, so another video here. Today, different month, different you know year, um, next year. So we're halfway there. Um, it's already August. Yeah, in a couple of months it's gonna be cold here again. Yeah, and then December it's gonna be winter again. So everybody's wearing jackets again, hoodies, whatever. And that's it. That's the way life is. You know, make some money, collect the money, work hard, you know, spend less, be frugal, and be smart with your money. Nowadays, especially with the coronavirus, you gotta be really smart, unless you make millions of money, or you are already wealthy. So guys, I'll see you next time, and sayonara, peace out.